Alright, so this is a basic OMSI tutorial for dummies. So here we are at the starting menu. And we're going to choose a basic map for just so we can start this tutorial. So here you're going to click load map without buses. And you're going to choose, we're going to, for this we're going to choose the gun north map. That comes with the game. So does the one that was selected before. And you're going to load whatever driver you have. You gotta create a driver. So a personal file, you're gonna say create new driver. That's option up there. And then you type in driver's name, information, la la la. And we're gonna name this driver test. And he's gonna be a uh, male. See there. Now, he is the current driver. Mr. Test is not a current driver, as you can see there. Now, you're going to load the map. No, don't click load situation, just load map without buses, which is this option. And the map is gun door. And you click start. Now you gotta wait for it to load. Map loaded. That is an AI bus. That's not the bus we're going to drive. We're going to select a new bus. And I just gotta wait for the new bus menu to pop up. Okay, there we go. Of course, it's gonna be a man, and you have a variety of buses to choose from. But today, we're going to go with something simple. Let's do choose the D85. And you can change the colors if you want. Change the colors to stuff and stuff here, you see. Um, for now, I'm just gonna make those are different colors. Um, we're just gonna choose this one on the OMSI one because we're testing. And here you can choose change the number. It varies for different buses, but you know. Okay, so I'm gonna click OK. And make sure the depot is set to a maps depot. This is Gundorf, so it's set properly. And we're gonna choose our entry point. We're gonna choose Kraken Hoss. But you know, let's just burn off. Same place we are right now, so we don't have to go far. And just click OK. Now we wait for that. OK. Now, here's the bus. Now I'm going to show you the keys. As pressing the S key right now. Switch it through views. S. And now I'm signed we're in the inside view. Passenger view. Alright, we're going to use this view for now. Now, what you're going to have to do is, you're going to have to press the E key. That starts the electricity. The bus is on board electricity system. So you're going to press E. You hear that sound? That should be good. Now you're going to press M. The bus should start up. Right now the parking brake is applied. We're not going to apply it right now. You want to press N for neutral. That's the transmission. Then you can press D to put it in forward, which is drive. And then you should hear the bus switch gears. And you should hear that rattling noise. Now, the extra features, which is you turn on the light. You press 9 to turn on the bottom light. And by switching, you switch views with the arrow keys, by the way. And you're going to press 8 to turn on the lights above. And you press 7 to turn the lights on in the front by the driver by the doors. Alright, so I'm switching keys again. I'm using this key to switch views. As you can see. Alright, now what you're gonna do is we release the parking brake. We can do this by pressing the period key. This key. Alright, and now the controls are this is the left steering wheel right steering wheel. Again, six is the right steering wheel on the keypad, four is the left steering wheel on the keypad. Eight is drive. As you can see, I'm pressing eight. You hear the bus engine. And the two key on your keypad is the brake. See? Stop, slows down and stops the bus. 
Now, what you can do is we're gonna drive over to pick up some passengers. And you gotta be careful with this. This this simulator is extremely realistic and Okay, and now we're gonna learn how to set. We're gonna pry the parking brake so the bus doesn't roll off. Press period key. You should hear that. A shh sound. Now, let's, let's learn how to use some other features. W, wipers when it's raining. And you're gonna, this is the fan. For when the passengers complain, it's, gonna, it's too, the temperature inside the bus is too low. And this is the heat for when it's snowing and the temperature is too low. And now I'm gonna teach you how to use the IBIS, which is basically the illuminator. What we do is, first we set our route. The route for this map is a 76, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna type in, we're gonna click this one, it says Lini, so that's Karas. It's German for route, um, the destination number. I mean, the, you know what I mean, the route sign. All right, and we're gonna type in zero, seven, six, zero, zero. And then we're gonna type in enter. You should hear that clicking sound coming from that. And then we choose our route, our route run number. Zero run or zero two is usually the route number. Zero one is Krakenhaus, which is the destination from here. When you, when you reach Krakenhaus and you're coming back to Bernhoff, you reset it by setting zero two. And now we'll say this terminal where we're at right now. So we're gonna go ahead and reset it back to zero one, which is root zero one enter so it's reset it back to cracking house all right so the parking brake is applied now we use the arrow key again to move around and switch our views and now here's the fun part learning how to use the doors to apply the door brake you should hear a, a sound like this and you press this key the dash on the keypad. To open the front doors, you have to press both these keys, the asterisk and the back dash. So watch what happens when I press both keys at the same time. The door is open. Hello. Okay, and the passenger center. Now you're gonna close it. Doors close. Um just one more basic you're gonna need for Omzi. When you wanna open the windows, if it's still hung inside the bus, you click on the windows on the outside. We go to the exterior view. And that's pretty much sums up the basics it's from driving in Omzi. So you should be able to get driving in no time. Parking brake is still applied. Make sure you disengage both the parking brake and the dash key. This is an OMSI for dummies.